Okay, so this is a video on how to share a post from the farmer's market page. Of course, it applies to any post anywhere, but uh, we're specifically talking about how to help the farmer's market, especially on Friday mornings, because uh, I, I put up a post every Friday morning that tells everyone what's going on at the market on Saturday, and that's the, the most important one to share, of course, but you can share any of them. All right, so this is my my personal home page. So if, 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 I, if you click home up here, right, it will take you to yours. Over here, it will give you some shortcuts. Uh, on mine, it has the West Side Farmer's Market, but we're not going to navigate that way because you may not have that over there. So what you'd want to do, if you don't see the post from the market already here in your timeline, right, then you can go up to the search bar and look for West Side Farmer's Market. Click on that. And then you're on the Farmer's Market page. All right, so once you're here, you wanna find that uh, top post. So it's sometimes you gotta scroll through a bunch of junk to get to it. <laughs> I don't like the way they lay these pages out these days, but that's the way it is. All right, so we finally get down and, and to the post you're looking for, and on Friday mornings, I will pin it right here. It will be at the top one, and it will have this little pin thing there, and it will say what's going on at the market. All right, so, uh, th so how do you share? All right, first off, you can like or love it. You should love it um, because that's better. And then there's you can also comment, of course, down here. Here's a comment misspelled, uh, but that's how you do it. And then you click enter and it goes. And then the most important thing to do actually is to share the post. So you can, I'm gonna, hang on, let me do this and make sure that I'm viewing this as me and not the page. And then you're gonna click share and you get all these options here. So it's very confusing uh, if you've not done it very, very often. The most important one is the second one here. It just says share. You click on that. And this little window is going to come up. It says share on your timeline. That means your personal one. You're going to type something there like, this is awesome. Please check it out. Or something more profound, whatever you want to do. Uh, and then you're going to click post. And the reason you want to comment on it is because that draws attention to it for your friends uh if you just share something without comp saying something about it it's you know people are like okay but if you tell them why you think it's important it's even better all right so i'm gonna i'm gonna cancel that um another thing you can do is share it to a group so if you're a member of a, a group that might actually be interested in coming to the market you can do that. You can share it. So I'm going to, for example, I'm going to do growing West side, which you won't have to do because I will have already done it. <laughs> but if you remember some other group that's in the neighborhood that might be interested in the farmer's market or whatever, you can share it to the group. Again, you're going to say something here, say something and click post. And then it will share it to that, all the members of that group. So that's pretty good. Uh, there's enough, there, let's see, look at the other options up here. Um, you can share it in an event or to a friend's timeline. Maybe it's a specific friend you want to know about it. You can share it to their timeline. Uh, you click on that, type in their name, say something. Hey, you want to go to this, right? Uh, okay, so that's how you like and share a post from the farmer's market if you have any questions do reach out to me and let me know and i'll see if i can help you thanks guys